Hello developers, welcome on Mr. Mango channel. Guys, I'm Ramkesh Singh and in today's video, we are going to learn how we can create the setup for EXE. Guys, in Unity, when we create the build, so we got the bunch of files. But in the production, we don't want that much file. We want just only single EXE. So how you can do in the Unity? Guys, in the Unity, Unity doesn't provide any system so that we can create the single EXE. So for this, we have to use the other uh, software so we can create the single EXE single setup. So in this studio video, we are going to learn this. And if you are new on the channel, make sure subscribe the channel. Want to ask something? Drop your question in the comment box. So let's start the today video. So we are on my PC. And first thing what you have to do is that you have to go on the Google and search Eno setup. You will get the Eno setup here is your website grsoftware.org. Just click there. And after that you will get the Eno setup. So guys just let's click here. Download Eno setup. And here you will get so you can just download it and install it. And then after let's go in unity so as i have taken one unity project for example to show you and you know very well if you are on the pc so just convert it if you are not on the pc and then here is your player setting so as you know very well in the player setting you can just put your name you put your game name here is the product name and here is company name version and you can put here the default logo and guys here is the resolution whatever you want you want to run, run in background so there are so many things you can just work with this and then after that you have to create the build so just i have done this thing to saving the time and here is my build win here are so many files like here is mono bleeding and here are so many more files here is test data and guys here is the few others file like tlr and with DLL so what we have to do is that we have to just combine this bunch of data in the single exe so how we are going to do it so let's do it guys so I have already you know setup so let's search it and guys I have tried so many setup to create I have tried so many software to create this single exe single setup but guys I found you know setup is a play a very important uh, is a very easy to use and guys I find it very useful so let's open it so here is my Eno setup and let's create the creating new script using the script wizard and ok go for next and here is your game name so what is game name what is the product name so here is product name is test so I am using the test here define your application version so mine is 0.1 company name instead mango and guys for website you can use any website so right now Oh, let me provide one link any link you can provide if you have any YouTube channel or if you have any website so let me provide my blogging channel if you haven't subscribed yet so you can just subscribe okay so just copy it let's put and then next and guys here you don't have to do anything just go for it and guys here you have to do the all the things so what I am trying to do is that we have to provide the exe here so let's browse here okay so
Where is there any? No. Where is my test project? Yeah, here it is. So here is test. So go inside it. Hmm. Builds. Okay, guys. So here is my window. Here is all the data. So what we are going to do is the first we are providing the exe so this is the test exe so just open it and uh, after that you have to just choose other files so let's do it again so i am going to choose unity crash unity player dll window wix even runtime and let's open it and guys i didn't try this thing because these are the files only single files so just i attach them if you want to attach the folder so you have to just add the folder go on the pc and then you have to go in d not d e there is unity project and there is test and here is builds so guys here you can choose the folder name but guys it doesn't work it doesn't work because it doesn't take the mono bleeding edge if you are selecting it so what it will it will take this embedded runtime so what we have to do is now just we have to play a game with it Okay, let's minimize it okay so what game we have to play is that uh, we have to just use one trick you know when you are choosing mono bleeding is so it will not take the mono bleeding is it will take the embedded runtime so what we can do is that we have to just rename it and copy it create one folder that is the data and you have to just drag date mono bleeding inside the data and here is your mono bleeding and what you have to do is that this is the data so we are going to play a simple trick because unity does not provide anything to create the setup so here is the crit you have to just pass this and after that it it will access the mono bleeding as because because in no setup just it you know setup want uh, your other folder with the exe file so that's why i'm doing the same thing and you have to do again it so create one folder because you have two folder so what is the name data again we have to rename it test data because we want to test data inside the data so just drag this test data inside the data okay and rename it So guys, this is our exe. On the same level, we got again our folder's name. So what it will does is we when we provide the test data, so it will get this this folder. Okay. So let's do inside the inner setup. Here is our L. This PC Unity projects, and here is my test. Here is my build. Here is my window, and here is let's select both. Not both, man. You can at a time. This is the test.
it at one time we can choose one so just choose not this you have to choose the parent so okay yes because you want to also access the children let's do same thing again so here is your not e f here is your unity projects here is your test and guys here is your build and again we want to access one data that is the test data so just okay it and yes guys whatever you want to to provide the data with your exe setup so you can just access here it may be your file it may be your folder even you can choose another exe here but it will not install it will just uh, it will just create one setup with the exe, single exe so just go for next and again next and here you can provide the license file i am not providing anything mod install for users and here nothing you have to do it next and here you can choose your language your application language so for me english is the best language and guys here you can provide the custom compiler uh, output folder and here is your setup name like if you are creating the setup so uh, this name will be test because we are creating the test and next next and again next and finish so it will create one script you can also you can change from here if you want to change anything so just create the yes yes and here it will ask for to save so test script and here you have to save it and then run it so right now we are running and it will after compiling this it will create one output folder and there you will get your setup and you can also run from here so first let's compile it so guys we have run and again you can run so it will just launch your application but we don't want to launch right now we just want open output folder so guys you will see here is our output folder window output folder here is the our build and after running it you will able to install it like this yes So it will ask where you want to install next create a shortcut so you can choose next next it will install but i don't want to install it so hope you got the idea and guys hey guys hope you got the idea how you can create the single exe for your project so if video is useful for you so drop a beautiful comment in the comment box and connect me on the instagram twitter as well as so thank you so much for watching. Have a good day. Keep learning. Keep growing. See you in the next video.